Dear Tim and Moby, What's temperature? From Zach. All the matter in the universe is made out of tiny particles called atoms, which can be combined into slightly larger particles called molecules. Atoms and molecules are on the move all the time. All this molecular movement creates heat energy. Temperature is a measure of heat or how fast those molecules are moving. The more you heat something, the faster the molecules move. This is what causes its temperature to rise. There's really no such thing as cold. Cold is just an absence of the molecular motion that causes heat. Boiling water has a higher temperature than cold water simply because its molecules are moving around more. Temperature is measured using a thermometer. There are three main scales by which temperature is measured. The Celsius, or centigrade scale, is the most widely used and it's based on the behavior of water. Water freezes at 0 degrees Celsius and boils at 100 degrees Celsius. The Fahrenheit scale, used primarily in the United States, is a little less straightforward. Pure water freezes at 32 degrees Fahrenheit and boils at 212 degrees Fahrenheit. The Kelvin scale is a favorite of scientists because it begins at the absolute coldest anything can get. This temperature is also called absolute zero and it equals zero kelvins. At absolute zero, all molecular motion stops. There's always some molecular motion, so you won't ever actually see absolute zero. Deep space gets close, but even there, the cosmic background radiation from the Big Bang keeps things slightly above zero kelvins. More temperature stuff? Uh, heated gases expand, making them less dense. Air near the Earth's surface is heated by sunlight striking the ground. This warm air rises, and cooler, denser air from higher in the atmosphere sinks down to take its place. The warmer air cools off, and the cooler air warms up, creating a convection current. That, along with the rotation of the Earth, is where the wind comes from. When matter heats up, it has a tendency to expand. This is how thermometers work. A liquid, like mercury, is sealed in a glass tube. Heat makes the molecules of the fluid move more rapidly and expand. The liquid rises, showing us the temperature. Why?